Okay, so we've got most of this helmet prepped now, that's it masked off and sanded back. And uh, just so you have a quick blow off with the gun to get rid of some of the, the debris, which I'll need to do. You just want to get right into all the, the cracks and seams. Just blow out as much of that shit as possible. Obviously we'll give this a wipe down with the uh, panel wipe uh, before we prime it and with a tack cloth as well. Um, this particular helmet here is going to be done in, in the Royal Engineers colours, um, which is a red with two blue stripes will be going down the centre of the helmet here. And we'll be using decals on the side for the logo because the customer couldn't afford to pay to have that airbrushed on. So he's actually given me or sent me um, these decals here for the uh, cap badge which as I say we'll just place on and lacquer over the top of it and um, the colour we're looking at or the base colour for the, the red is here and um, the actual colour for Royal Engineers is a Pantone colour but they had problems with the, uh, the paint shop with being able to mix that and um, the closest colour we found was he's written Carmen red here it's actually Carmen wrote this what it will appear on your chips as it's a Renault industrial paint um, for their trucks. So we'll get the paint on that later on and then give it a coat of lacquer, get it masked off for the stripes and then get the decals done. Final clear over the top of that and then get it flattened and polished and then out the door.